Hello, dear student doctors. My name is Talai Trebotov. I'm an assistant in surgery department in International School of Medicine. Today, in a short video, we're going to talk about measurement in traumatology and orthopedics. In this video, we are going to learn how to measure absolute and the relative lengths of the upper and the lower limbs. In order to do so, we need to have this item. This is called measurement tape and a marker in order to mark the points. So today we're gonna use skeleton in order to demonstrate where to start and where to finish. And also we have one patient in order to uh, demonstrate the weight we measure on the real person. In the measurement of the lens, we need to know two things. The first is there is an absolute lens and a relative lens. And the second is that we have to know two points. Points where it starts and the point where it finishes. Relative lens of the upper limb starts from a cronium process until the tip of the third finger. Absolute lens of a shoulder segment starts from a cronium process until the olecranon process. At this case, elbow joint should be flexed to 90 degrees. Absolute length of the forearm starts from the olecranon process to the styloid process of ulna. On the real patient, we have to mark the points. A cronium process, one point. Second point is the tip of the third finger. It should be straight. Okay, another point in the should be marked in the elbow joint, which is olecranon process. Olecranon process, the tip of the olecranon process. And the fourth point is styloid process of alma. Yeah. The measurement is exactly the same as in the skeleton. We start from acronym process till the tip of the third finger. This is the relative length of the upper. Absolute length of the shoulder segment starts from the acronym process to the tip of the olecranon process. Absolute length of the forearm is from olecranon process until the styloid process of alma. And remember, when we measure the lens, we have to always compare with the other side, and it should be equal. In the lower limb, we have exactly the same lens, absolute and relative. The relative lens of the lower limb starts from ASIS until the medial malleolus. Okay, we measure this one. On the real person, we have to make the mark on the skin. Okay, absolute lens of a thigh segment starts from greater trochanter and finish on lateral fissure of the knee joint. Absolute length of a leg segment starts from the lateral fissure of the knee joint until the lateral malleolus, or from the medial fissure to the medial malleolus. <laughs> 